the Celium. His pal is Mowgli, a three-year-old lion at Chester Zoo. They've been fast friends since Mowgli was a cub and Peter a pup. Mrs. Lion's babies are just 14 weeks old. To Chester have come Barbara, the polar bear, and her mate from the Arctic, and Molly, the Malayan bear from the tropics, to say nothing of Trotsky from Siberia. Marmaduke, the mournful monk, is Monica the monkey house, and the parrots are in great profusion. Some are very, very sleepy. The grounds of Chester Zoo are among the prettiest in the north. They are spacious enough to provide ample grazing for bison. It's feeding time and Millicent is on her rounds. She has the knack of getting friendly with the animals on sight. And just now she's going to lunch with the dingoes, the native dogs of Australia. There's an open air pit in the grounds, a sort of food trap for hungry bears. After a bite, they can have a bath. Wolves are always camera shy, but we got them. The peahen is a much less glamorous creature than her mate, the peacock. And here is that gentleman himself. The lady in the funny hat is a crown crane. For the kiddies, no visit is complete without a ride on the Heffalant. And there's always a queue. But the big favourites at Chester Zoo are our old friends Mowgli and Peter. They're real buddies. <laughs> 